everyone, welcome back to CBO Wellness. My name is Ali, and today we are going to be talking about what is mindful sex and how to have mindful sex. So mindfulness is this buzzword term that is showing up, I feel like, everywhere in the world. Everyone's practicing mindfulness. Um, there are so many great health benefits and mental health benefits to help improve your life. Um, but I want to today talk about how mindfulness can actually help improve your sex life as well and the research behind it. Um, mindfulness is an incredible tool that we can use during sex. Um, so today's video is all about how to have mindful sex, what it is, and how you can start to practice it with your partner. Mindfulness is the process of sitting and becoming aware of our thoughts, um, but not letting our thoughts become fact. So beginning to acknowledge and realize that all thoughts are actually just mental events. They pass, they don't hold any true factual components to them, they're just thoughts. So what you can do when you're practicing mindfulness is you can actually start to categorize your thoughts into three different categories. So there are pleasant thoughts, there are neutral thoughts, and then there are unpleasant thoughts. So if you're practicing mindfulness through general meditation, um, obviously when we sit down, our brains are like monkey minds, right? They go all over the place. Um, and a really simple way to practice mindfulness through meditation is just sitting and when a thought comes up, acknowledging, okay, that's a thought, Maybe you label it as pleasant, neutral, or unpleasant, and then you try to bring your attention back to some sort of sensation in your body. So maybe it's your breath, right? Or maybe it's just the feeling of your fingertips together. Um, so constantly training the mind to come back to the present moment and to let go of any of those thoughts. As humans, we tend to gravitate towards pleasant thoughts and pleasant emotions, um, and we tend to try to avoid the unpleasant, um, and we push it away, and the neutral we're just bored of, and so we don't really pay that much attention to it at all. So what mindfulness helps us do is it helps us acknowledge that all of those emotions, pleasant, neutral, or unpleasant, are all temporary. They're not factual, they're just experiences, and by letting them go and coming back to the present moment and where we are in our bodies right now, where we can actually enjoy the experience that we're in instead of getting wrapped away in other thoughts. How does mindfulness help with sex though and how do we have mindful sex? So oftentimes when people have sex, it's the same as what happens to your brain when you are, you know, at work or maybe at a dinner party or, um, you know, going for a run. Our minds can start to wander in sex just like they can start to wander in any other situation of our life. Um, so you might be having a sexual experience with someone, but you're not actually very present there for it. You're thinking about, you know, your phone bill that you have to pay or what you're going to do later that night or, you know, you're focusing on maybe an argument that you had had with your partner um, and that's getting in the way of your sexual experience. So being mindful during sex is um, a really, really, really great tool to help us enhance our pleasure um, and potentially help us have more orgasms during sex. So how to practice mindful sex. Um, you're going to do the same thing that you would do while you're practicing mindfulness during a meditation, which is becoming aware of our thoughts and letting them go. So if you have a thought pop into your mind during sex, you might label it as, oh, that's a pleasant thought, that's a neutral thought, or that's an unpleasant thought. And then you're going to start to return your attention back to your body. And specifically, I would choose one body part. So whatever your partner in that moment is stimulating might be something that you bring your attention to. It might be your clit. It might be, you know, their hands, wherever their hands are on your body. It might be how they feel inside of you. Um, so bringing your attention back to that very physical sensation in the moment is going to help you block out any of those thoughts that may be distracting you from your pleasure. Um, because sometimes we're so distracted that we miss out on the cues in our body of what's actually happening for us. Uh, and then we miss out on all this amazing pleasure that we could be having. Um, some handy tips for mindful sex is that you can actually ask your partner as well to remind you. So your partner every you know few minutes can say, um, you know, focus on this, or do you feel me touching you here? And you can communicate back like, yes, that feels good, da 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 da, da. Uh, By making it a collaborative and both of you being very in the moment and very intentional about where you're putting your focus and trying as often as possible, like through your mindfulness practices when you're meditating, you bring your mind back to the physical sensation, 
during a sexual experience, you want to be bringing your mind back to that physical sensation. Um, and you'll start to pick up, hopefully, on the different areas of pleasure that you're experiencing. Maybe areas that you didn't even know you experienced pleasure in because you just weren't paying attention to them. The purpose of mindful sex is not actually orgasm, and I would never tell you to focus on orgasm as your you know, end goal. The purpose of mindful sex is to focus on pleasure. So you just want to be making sure that the experiences you're going through feel pleasurable, right? Um, and if you get to a, a, a maybe a moment where it's not pleasurable, that's where communication comes through, right? So we acknowledge that, oh wait, that doesn't feel good anymore, my body. Instead of going off on a tangent in your mind, instead you come back to the body and you communicate to your partner, maybe touch me here instead, or move your arms this way, or let's try this. Um, and then you move back into your body and back into those sensations. Um, because all sensations are temporary, just like thoughts, they're going to pass. Um, but focusing on pleasure and trying to stay present in that pleasure during sex um, is going to be mind-boggling for you. Um, so, you know, you can pick one body part, you can just pick, you know, wherever their hands are, but um, bringing your attention back to that moment, just like you would with your thoughts during a meditation, um, can help enhance your sex and help make mindful sex way more enjoyable, way more pleasurable, and end, in my personal experience, in more orgasms because you are so in tune with your body um, that you are really there for the experience and you're not just on autopilot. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please give it a big thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe. Give us a follow at CBO Wellness on Instagram. We share tons of different sex, relationship, um, yoga advice all the time. So give us a follow there. And thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And we'll see you for another one shortly.